Come in. What's your name? Alice. She's running a fever. We've spent the last few nights outside. She's exhausted. There's a spare room upstairs. You can put her to bed and I'll bring her something to eat. Adam, will you show them upstairs? Before heading upstairs, <clears throat> oh, I thought I could. Okay. I thought I could read the magazine. But unfortunately, we still need to bring Alice upstairs so she can relax and take a rest. Can't blame her, man. She is exhausted. We were traveling non-stop till Todd died, so... I guess there's no harm for her to rest a little. She is the only human. set off again tomorrow why do humans hate us we didn't do anything wrong hmm misunderstanding they need some misunderstanding maybe they just need time to understand what we really are why can't we just talk to each other they'd see we're not bad I don't know I really don't know I don't know what you like, but I made you Rose's world famous spaghetti. You'll be back on your feet in no time. There's something for her fever. Thank you. I'll get these washed and dried. Mmm, suggest eating, man. You need to eat something. You haven't had anything since we left. Promise me you'll try? I'll be downstairs if you need anything. Get some sleep. And tomorrow, you'll be stronger than me. I'll stay with her a while. Okay, we'll talk to Rose. I let the big guy take care of her. Okay, I think all of the, the rooms are close. So there's no point snooping around. Might as well go directly to Rose. Ask what she knows, and maybe she can give us information on how to cross the border and into Canada. I'm Kara. This is my son, Adam. I'm Rose, but you know that already. Come and have a seat, Kara. So are you going to tell me what a deviant's doing in the snow with a little girl? Her father was beating her. When I saw what was happening, 
Something snapped inside of me. All of a sudden, I felt like her life was more important than mine. I had to protect her. So we ran away. I understand. Mm. We're not the first ones to come here. These past few weeks, we've seen more and, and more. I don't know what's going on, but something's happening. Helping androids is dangerous. Why take the risk? When the first one arrived last year, <laughs> he was so lost and confused. We hid him here for a while, but all he wanted to do was cross the border. They shot him on the spot. So when the next android showed up, I just knew I had to help him. We've heard you help androids cross the border. Can you help us? The only way is over the river, and it's mostly frozen in winter. It's very risky. And after that android speech on TV, everybody's on edge. It's probably safer for you to stay here until things settle down. Oh, man. We can't keep hiding like this. Alice needs to feel safe and have a normal life. We have to get across that border. No matter what. Please. You've got to help us. Rose, come quickly. Oh, frick. I don't like that. Check what's going on. What's going on? It's Mary. She just shut down. Ah, also an android. Okay. We escaped together. We used to talk about what we would do once we got across the border. I loved her. I loved her more than anything. What will I do without her? Should be resting. I wasn't sleepy. She didn't want to stay in her room any longer. You all right, Carol? Yes. I'm fine. Okay, see Rose. I wonder what's happening to Kara. As soon as Tyler said said something did today it's too dangerous do you know what will happen if the police find them here we'll go to prison mom do you understand me prison adam we've already talked about this I oh no i won't back down this time you're gonna ruin our lives and for what for a bunch of machines they are not machines they are alive i'm alive you're alive. They, they're nothing. And none of 
this would be happening if Dad was still here. I will not stand for that kind of talk. I'm not going to prison because you want to help these freaks. That is enough, Adam! That's enough! Man, so awkward. <laughs> Alice is just sitting here. Like she totally heard everything, the conversation, the argument. Oh man, I feel sorry for Rose. Don't mind him. Sometimes he just boils over. It's been hard since his dad passed away. But he's a fine boy. I'll go see about getting you across the border tonight, okay? You stay here. I won't be long. World War Three, damn. Who would win it if fighting does break in the Arctic? Who's going to win? America has less access to the area, but is surrounded by allies. Russia has a head start on technology. Their androids can work in sub-zero conditions. The U.S. Navy is stocked with Trojan and Myrmidon cyber life units which are specially adapted for marine combat where the Russians have invested heavily in ice cutter units capable of forging new paths through the solid ice. Both armies seem evenly matched and Harry Grayton, president of the World Council of Territorial Disputation, has described both US and Russian claims to Arctic territory as equally tenuous and equally cynical neck and neck of arctic competition oh man treat yourself ax400 starting at just 8.99 dang so expensive wait is that is that me whoa the police oh frick it's the police They know we're here. We have to open the door. I knew this was going to happen. I knew it. Shit. Got 28. Just keep calm, Adam. Everything will be all right. Frick, 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 frick. Come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. We got 17 seconds left. Hurry, Luther. Take Alice and hide upstairs. Come on, Alice. Okay, 15 seconds. Frick, 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 frick. Just the last one. Just the last one. What? Find evidence. Shit, six seconds. Frick, what? Good evening, ma'am. Sorry to disturb you. We've had reports of androids in the area. With all this deviant business going on, you can't be too careful. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? May I come in? Of course. Evening, young man. Good evening. 
Oh man, we left one evidence. I wonder what the frick is that. Would you like a cup of coffee? I'd love one. Have you noticed anything unusual recently? Any unexpected visitors? No. No, nothing in particular. Is anyone else in the house? There's... There's my daughter. She's asleep upstairs. Oh man, this is freaking... Oh. I hope the police just freaking leaves. Do you have any androids here? Uh... We used to for helping in the garden, but we got rid of it. Oh. oh shit What's the freaking last evidence man? Thanks Come on Freaking leave already. Okay, suspicion level is ten percent. Twenty five percent. It's okay. Seems to have woken up. Okay, I think it's just the magazine that he saw, so I What's your name, son? Adam. M my name is Adam. Is everything all right, Adam? The, the androids, they, he, he's just shaken up about this deviant business. Do you know anything about deviants? Have you seen any? No. No, I, I haven't seen anything. Oh man, this freaking shite. He's so suspicious. I better go. Thanks for the coffee. Have a nice evening. Oh, frick. Somebody else in the house? It's nothing. The, the washing machine. It's an old model. It makes a terrible racket. Sorry for the convenience. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening, Adam. Okay, that didn't... No, no, that did. That was pretty alright. Ah, twenty-five percent. It's okay, Alice. We'll be safe now. It's Rose. Get yourselves ready. We leave tonight. Oh man, that was freaking close. Okay, let's see here. Read magazine. Explore the house. Adam returns. Let's uh, let Alice see Mary. Okay, pretty much. 
hide blue blood pouches, find and hide evidence upstairs, reassured Adam, made coffee, police sees article, police questions Adam, policeman fooled, okay majority of us had the right decision for making the police leave so that's okay. That's more than okay, actually. <laughs> it's a good thing, man. Okay, it's Marcus now. Frick! We just lost Simon there. Our broadcast is all over the news. Now humans know. They took Marcus's message as a threat. He did the right thing. This is the only language humans understand. Violence is never the answer. A confrontation will get us nowhere. Simon paid with his life. Simon gave his life for our cause. What difference does that make? He's a hero. He died for the revolution, and he won't be the last. I don't want a revolution that spills blood. Then live as a slave. Because if you're not willing to fight for your freedom, maybe you don't deserve it. North, don't you That's do enough! And now what are we going to do? Ah, oh, Marcus. Even Marcus has a freaking terrible decision. Not terrible, but there are five cyber life very hard. All selling us like merchandise. We're going to attack those stores and set our people free. Attack stores? No, we've never done that before. They're probably protected. They have security systems. <laughs> We break into five teams, one for each store. We hack their security systems, and we strike. Simultaneously at 2 a.m., no violence. We free our people, get them out of there before the police come. This is a night our people will remember. Again, uh, Marcus's story is very complicated. Oh man, I really don't want to kill the humans. But I like Nort, man, and she's very aggressive. I've been waiting a long time for this. Yeah, I, actually, I really personally I like North, but her methods are very uh, aggressive. Like she likes to make trouble, kill humans as possible. There's probably even more police in the area. We should be careful. The store's over here. I'll convert this guy, so at least Whoa. Let's convert as much as possible here. You're awake now. Go to Jericho. To commemorate the invention of androids. superior to them but they are our masters that's about to change you are free and also we have to yeah I was wondering about that because I was supposed to have revenge for Leo for making for making us an idiot framing us for the death of what was the name of the old guy 
Okay, I think that's everyone. We'll go to north now. That's what we are to them. Just merchandise on display in a shop window. Soon they'll know what we really are. Let's get them out. Or we'll stick to the plan. We'll neutralize the alarm systems and secure the area. There's ten minutes until all our teams attack. Waiting for. Okay, secure the area. We're gonna sweep the plaza. Make sure we're not disturbed. And how do you want to deal with the shop window? Not now. One problem at a time. Okay, now what? Okay, we've got What's next. Ten minutes. What are we going to do, man? You'll soon be with us. Okay, that was weird. Analyze the store window, scout the area. There's traffic on the road. We need to block it. It's one way, it shouldn't be too difficult. Exactly what we need to ram the store. What are we waiting for? Oh man, there's a freaking guy there. I freaking. Oh shit. Can I go back? I need to convert those guys. Okay, now we're in. Let's get that truck out. Shit. Oh, nice. Can use this one. I still have nine minutes left. Okay, good. Let's convert these guys. You're free now. Okay, good. There. Nobody should bother us now. Okay, there's one more there. Frick, I forgot. I still have eight minutes left. Go, go, go. Come on. Oh, there's still androids here. Okay, that was weird. Where's the drone? Ok, 
Okay, we still have eight minutes left. <laughs> 